Hey guys, James here today and welcome back to The Sims 4 Rags to Riches Seasons. Baby is real sad. Probably because it's like in a dark room with no windows or anything. Which, I mean, look, I don't blame the baby. That's, I would probably feel the same way. But I'll feed you and then I'll cuddle and then, then I'll uh, make a silly face and then you'll probably be fine after that and it'll all be good. But welcome back to this beautiful world that we live in. <laughs> what is going on with our garden? So I really want to, I've decided I want to have a dog in this, but I also don't imagine that I'm going to be able to get the dog that I want if I use the, uh, the in-game adopt function, which for some reason is always on higher service. That always confuses me. Let me see. Let me see what I can do. Um, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, no, see this, the way I'm going to do it, so it costs $200 to adopt a pet. So what I'm going to do, we're going to go testing cheats on. I'm going to go cast up full edit mode. Is that the cheat? I don't even know. We're going to do that, and then we're going to just go into create a sim, and we'll just add uh, a dog, the one we want, and then we'll just, we'll just subtract $200. But, you know, because there's so many comments about how Raggy kept reminding them of um, <laughs> Scooby-Doo trying to say Shaggy. I was like, well, we should have a dog called Scooby then, right? So that's what we're going to do. You know, actually, the, the best way to do this, instead of me trying to make it, which is going to be a bloody nightmare, I want to just delete that. We're going to go find on the gallery a dog called Scooby-Doo. That'll probably be a lot easier. And someone's probably already made a really good version of them. So let's go item name. I guess Scooby-Doo. Let's see. Uh, most popular. Scooby-Doo. Mm, I like that one better. Uh, wait, let's have a look. So this one, Scooby-Doo, where are you? We need some help from you now. Scooby-Doo, where are you? This guy, I like this guy because he's a little bit more colorful. You know what I mean? It's actually a Great Dane because the Scooby-Doo is supposed to be a Great Dane. It's a Great Denoise one. Okay, whatever that is. Also, wait, he has <laughs> eyebrows. Wait, what does Scooby-Doo actually look like? Scooby-Doo, I know it's similar to that, but let me look, images. Scooby-Doo have eyebrows? Oh my god, he actually does have eyebrows. Okay, well maybe we <laughs> maybe we go with this one. This is actually pretty good, I like it. I'm gonna put that in. Add. Add to household. Do it now! Oh, are you a pup? Wait. No, you're a full-size dog. You don't look like a Great Dane though, but... He looks so sad. So what are you? You are glutton, you are jumpy, and you are couch protect. Yep, that's perfect. What do you sound like? Lovely. <laughs> Welcome to the family. All right, so now we have Scooby-Doo joining the family. Actually, oh, maybe we should have made him a puppy to start off with. Uh, but then it'll be Scrappy-Doo. No, we, we, yeah, it's fine. We'll start off with this. Now, the problem is uh, we need stuff to take care of a dog. Hey, what's up? What are you doing? Why are you standing there with your nose on it? All right, so we need... Well, actually, here's the thing. We need to... We've got a bit of money, which is good stuff. Okay, let me just turn on all the lights first. Turn on... Uh, all lights. Uh, we need stuff for a baby. Well, a toddler, actually. I'm going to get rid of that shower because that's annoying as hell. I'm going to get a proper... Sh actually, you know what? I'm going to get one of these. I know I never get these. In every series, everyone's like, why don't you just... Because we need a bathtub and a shower. They're like, why don't you just get a combo? And I normally don't get them because I really dislike them because they're huge and they get in your way. But in this case, this family's all about being different. It's all about something unique. Let's go for a beautiful... Greeny, no, it's like a turquoisey, turquoisey. Yeah, that's turquoise, isn't it? I don't know. Sure, let's go with that. We'll get that. So we got the bathtub to wash the dog. We also need some dog-related stuff. So let's go pets. And we're gonna go in here. We'll get. Uh, should we get an auto feeder? I mean, that's a lot of money. Let's just get a. Let's just get a regular feeder. How about that? Uh, cash me inside. How about that? <laughs> right, let's put that there. We got a little bowl, and we don't. I mean, they don't need a bed. They don't have to sleep in a bed, but we'll get one. Um, you can sleep with the baby. Sleep in the baby's room. There you go. Uh, you can have a nice... Uh, that one there. It looks like a nice little quilt to lie on. And then maybe we'll get a little toy box uh, as well. Do we need a toy box? I mean, we don't need a toy box. Nah, screw it. We don't need it. All right. All right, Scooby. What's up? Now, I'm going to go say... Can I... Uh, actually, let me just call you over because I don't want to go outside. Come over here, Scooby. Good dog. Welcome. Welcome to the fam. Hey, mate. Uh, let's go talk to. I'm going to get to know you a little bit better. I'll give you a treat. And I'm going to... Also, I guess I'll go fill up the bowl for five bucks. While you take care of baby. Baby born, baby born. Oh, change dirty diaper now. Go do that. And then... 
I guess we'll talk maybe a little bit. Talk and uh, maybe a little bit more cuddling. And then after you've done that, I'm going to get you to go get leftovers and you go to sleep. And then I'm also going to go uh, auto lights, all lights. Because we need to save money on bills because we don't make that much money. And plus, we now have a dog and we're going to have a second child. So <laughs> we are, And we're still at the point where we don't have wallpaper or enough windows. All right, so we've done that. Now let me go pet. I would like to hug. Scooby Doo. <laughs> what is this let's play? I don't even know, but it's fun. It's so dumb. All right. Anyway, now that you're there, join. Welcome to the welcome to the fam. Um, you're kind of he's going to be there. He's not really going to be the focus of this let's play. I can tell you that much. <laughs> he's certainly not. Are these done? I assume so. He doesn't tell me. Uh, unload and put away. Let's go do that. Hard work is paid off and it's been leveled up. Good stuff. Oh, actually, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, you know what? What I will do? Let's just get let's get some wallpaper because before I was gonna do. Wait, do we get wallpaper before windows or do we get windows before wallpaper? Oh, wallpaper is expensive, man. Oh, it's still. I forgot how laggy it is now too. One forty-four. See, the thing is, windows are only thirty bucks because we really need. Well, we need more windows to go around the whole place. Oh, also, you guys are like, why are there two doors right, right next to each other? Which, look, is a fair point, but also that's just where it ended up being. We're going to be doing more renovations, so it'll change later on. Um, and I think one important thing to note in this let's play is please don't take anything too seriously because this is the most ridiculous let's play that we've done in a while. So <laughs> do not take it too seriously. Right, we we'll get a little bit of wallpaper. We're still missing a few rooms, but that's pretty good. Um, let's also go, what are these? Oh, they're just on my holly bushes that are just randomly there. Oh, that's what I want to do. Whoops. Uh, I would like to add, someone suggested we do holidays for the first day of each season, which would be kind of cool. It's a cool idea. What do we have there? Queen's, but oh, it's Queen's birthday. <laughs> the Queen's birthday is back. Yes. I mean, it's like three weeks away, but it's there. So we've got Halloween coming up this Thursday. We've got Summerfest. Now, actually, there was a, there were a few good suggestions for holidays. We're going to find them now. There were a few silly ones, actually. I think there was one... Oh, yeah, there's actually a lot of people asking about... This is not related to holidays. A lot of people asking about doing a, a flower store, like a retail store, and I actually don't want to do that because a lot of these racks of riches, we have just done stores in the last few ones, so I think we'll give that a miss this time, at least for now. Um, let's see... Uh, I'm trying to find some holiday suggestions. You should create a holiday for your birthday and call it Maker's Day or something like that. Uh, well, my birthday's in winter. Winter's actually kind of full of holidays already. So it would have to be... I mean, you know what? I guess we can have a holiday every day, really, if we want to. Uh, April Fool's with uh, like mischievous spirit streaking, fighting. Yeah, that's that was a good one. I like that one. So April Fool's for us in real... Like here in Australia, what is that in autumn? I think it would be autumn here. April, yeah, which uh, would be all the way up there. I don't want to do that. We'll, we'll just do it wherever. It really doesn't matter. Let's do it. Uh, should we just do it today? No, we'll do it tomorrow just because we're already on today. Let's add a holiday for tomorrow. This is going to be uh, April. No, we won't call it April. Let's call it Fool's Day. And a decoration theme is not going to have any. You're not going to get a day off for it. So we're going to go ahead and do, uh, let's see, countdown to midnight. No, we're going to do, we're going to find some. No, oh, we, we could do fireworks. Games, we could do like gas, holiday gnomes. Not doing holiday gnomes. Mischievous spirit, we're going to do. Wait, what were the other ones? Streaking, we definitely want to do. Giving gifts, like I guess prank gifts, I think was the idea. Uh, na, 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 streaking. And I think, was it fighting as well was one of them? <laughs> fighting, yeah, okay. Let's do give gifts and fighting. There we go. Fool's Day. Beautiful. And this is going to be, what kind of little picture could we get? That one. There you go. Beautiful. So that's going to go there. Then we'll come up with some other ones later. Like, uh, we just spent so many, so much time just sitting there doing nothing. So let's worry about that later. What up, Doge? So you're now eating. Uh, and then you're going to go to bed, which is good. I'm going to get you. Uh, I guess you... Oh! The snow disappeared. I guess because it is spring. It just, it's gone. That's really sad. Oh no, it's all melting. Now, I guess that's probably why the hollies actually die, because it's no longer winter. Um, so I'm actually going to get rid of those, because I think... Well, we have hollies inside somewhere, right? Uh, which is fine. Begonia. Ho yeah, holly. All right, we'll get rid of the excess outside. We don't need them. Holly, holly. I think these are all hollies, right? What are these? Crocus. Crocus. Uh, I've said them wrong so many times. These do grow in spring, though, so we could just keep them for now. Um, the gnomes are just around, which is fine. 
Oh, those poor snow angels. I like how the snow angels are just left. Why didn't those disappear? Uh, all right, can I get you to go throw that away, actually? Clean that up a little bit. All right, so uh, how are we doing? We, uh, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty, pretty good. Oh, yeah, that's the thing I didn't do. I took the cutting, and you guys are like, you're like, you took the cutting, but you never actually did the splicing, which is a good call. I never did. Uh, what was it going on to again? Oh, chrysanthemum, I'm pretty sure. Wait, what do I have a cutting of? Oh, no, I already have chrysanthemum. It was going to tulips, wasn't it? Was it lilies? And you know what? Let's just double check that. <laughs> I know I checked it like five times last episode, but I don't remember. Uh, grafted tulip. Okay. Uh, which I think is over here somewhere. Tulip. Uh, graft. Hopefully this works because, um, it should be fixed, but it definitely was broken for one of the times. Oh my god, my bees are awake again. Yay! I miss my bees, but they are attacking me, which is a little sad. Hey guys. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna get one, hopefully, Birds of Paradise. Once that grows, then we can plant it and get four of them instead of just the one. Um, what other stuff should we get? I get, you know what, actually, let me look. Make an arrangement. What, what flowers can we do? Christmas rose. Like, what ones don't we have? Snowdrop. Like, there's a bunch of new ones, which I don't know how we get if they, we do it some other way, or... So, Birds of Paradise, we definitely have to do that. You know what, let me just have a look what it says about some of them. Okay, so Snapdragon. Graph with lilies to get orchids. Uh, which maybe we should do that. So Snapdragon and Lily. So I'm gonna take a uh, cutting of the Lily and then my Snapdragon. I guess my bees are not awake yet. They're still snoozing. And then Snapdragon is there. So we'll graft onto that. And also because we just need to graft three times. So we might as well. Um, graft that. What up, Doge? You good? Yep, you good. He's just sitting down. So graph that, and then what else could we get that might be useful for us? Let's have a look. Uh, no, we oh, actually, we I think we do need cow plant at some point. We'll worry about that later. Um, okay, so uh, there's nothing really on that. Nothing on that. Gifting. Graph with tulip, which we already knew. Uh, which we already knew that one. Oh, whoops, the same one. Daisy. I have a strawberry to get bonsai buds, which I don't really want. Begonia, there's nothing to do with those. Okay, so I don't really know what else we should graft. I don't know. Anyway, let me collect the swarm. Hey guys. Hey bees. Let me bond with you. Because you're still, in, you're in rage. I mean, you've been sleeping all of the winter. Like, you, you ditched me. You ditched me for all of winter. Oh no. That's sad. All right, well, I'm going to send you to fetch me a gift. Oh, I could have got you to pollinate nearby plants. It probably would have been a better option, I'll be honest. But whatever. Let's bond with them again. Where's my gift? Give me another gift. Uh, one fossilized three-toed footprint. Hmm. Nice. I'll sell it. Oh, no, I should have sold it on my table. Damn it. <laughs> uh, let's bond with the bees again. Bond! What is this dog doing? I don't think this dog has anything to do, so it just sits around and does nothing. He just sits. I mean, he's a good dog. I'll brush him. Get to know. Hug. I'll give you a big treat, and I'll... He just wags constantly, and I'm not going to train you. I don't have time to train you. I'm going to make an arrangement. Uh, oh, yeah, you guys were like, why don't you just order the price of the plants by the most expensive so I don't have to scroll all the way down? And I was like, yeah, you know what? That's a, probably a much better idea. Oh, and I'm also not in a great mood. So let me get my mood up first. I'm going to get some leftovers. Do we have any... Yeah, we do still have leftovers. Good, good, good. Yeah, you good. Good dog. Aw, oh, nice little hug. Oh, you guys also suggested I should probably really get more bees instead of just having the one. Which is not a bad idea. Should we get another bee box? Wait, how much are they? 265. I cannot afford another bee box right now. That's okay. Um, excuse me. Don't do that. Lecture about jumping on counters. Even though it's not really jumping on a counter, but it's kind of the same thing. I'm not okay with you putting your dirty mitts up there. Go talk to Raggy. Alright, if you want some company. Alright, so you're eating. You're sleeping now. Okay. How's Raggy doing? I feel like, um, like I feed Raggy. So I feel like Raggy's gonna cry soon anyway for food. Talk and we'll get a little bit of cuddle and then I'm gonna go to the toilet. And then, and only then, will I go stargazing. Because you guys suggested trying to do some stargazing before we actually go to do a flower arrangement. Because it might actually be better from being inspired. So we'll see if that's the case. Now let's go order by price the other way. 
which makes so much more sense. We'll do that and we'll make an arrangement. Oh yeah, see, because uh, it's glowing with the inspiration, it's definitely gonna give us a little boost to skill earning and hopefully the quality of it too. I mean, he's in a pretty good mood, so it should be good. And you're just sitting there. Can you please not sit there constantly? Because you turn the light on and then Raggy can't sleep with the light on. Ooh, look at all these flowers out here. Look at all these. Oh, it's spring. Na, 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 na. Well, I mean, we already knew that because we, we did see it, but that's fine. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, so the, I guess these will probably take a couple of days to actually grow. Also, it looks like we need to water plants again. It's been a while since we've watered the plants, actually. We haven't really done anything with them for a while. Um, we really, actually, that's what we need to do. I haven't done that yet for some reason. Well, we just plant another begonia there. We also, we, I guess we now need to plant another snapdragon and, um, I don't know, they, they grow in spring, which is good. So I'm actually going to put, I'll just plant one outside. I went, what was the other one? A tulip, which grows in spring too, which is perfect. So we'll just plant them outside for now. Uh, ooh, plant. How's that? How much is that worth? It's a masterpiece. $1,700. Hell. Damn. Okay, it's pristine masterpiece. Well, in that case, I think we're going to try and sell it on there. And let's also lock door for Emron, but uh, household members. And lock door for Emron, but household members. As you guys suggested, too. All right, let me just do that. Did you just go to the toilet? Lecture about drinking from the... I don't know if you went to the toilet outside or what happened, but it's better than doing it inside. So There's a lot of plants everywhere around the world, too, by the way. Which I think was <laughs> that was a bug where they were growing way too much. So there's a bunch of them everywhere. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on stock table. Look at that. I'm going to go, uh, needs to be, oh, tend table. I'm going to say markup prices, 200% start a yard sale. Now, the other thing is because these actually do, and you guys mentioned this as well, because they are technically like a perishable in the game, they will go off and the value will go down. So you want to sell this as quickly as possible uh, ideally. Now, the baby is stinking, so can I get you to go change dirty diaper and go rock and, and cuddle? Uh, shouldn't need to be fed because we just did that before, so get you to take a shower after that. Take a steamy shower. The other thing was, <laughs> when I was trying to upgrade stuff last, last episode, I swapped Sims by accident. You guys weren't happy about that. But I did I did upgrade in the end a little bit, so that's fine. Get you to throw all that stuff away. Oh, it was Raggy's birthday. I forgot it was Raggy's birthday. Time just flies, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, can we do a... We actually can't, we couldn't do a birthday event. That was the thing, wasn't it? Well, we'll make a cake ourselves and we'll, we'll celebrate. We'll celebrate. It'll be lovely. Uh, come one, come all to see my beautiful flower arrangement. Uh, oh, hello. Yes. Hello. Um, sales pitch. Yeah. And also sales pitch to everyone that's here. Because if someone, I marked that up 200%, so we're going to get... Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, well, that was good. Cool, thanks, guys. Bye. Uh, I, I guess it, it's over now. Sweet. Well, we just got a bunch of money, so let's go ahead and do some renovations. Okay, so I guess top of the list is, first of all, make it daytime so we can see a little bit better. I want to get the rest of the windows on the greenhouse, because the green, it's supposed to be a greenhouse. It's supposed to be windows everywhere, not just on those two sides. So it should be like that at the very least. Oh, we can see through the roof again now. That's beautiful. Now I can also do the lights and all that. Well, actually, the rest of the okay, the, little, the body of the house we gotta we gotta do something about that too. Um, I think what we need to do. Let me just put these gnomes away. We'll put them back out later, but they're just kind of in the way right now. So I would like to actually first of all, I want to fix this bit because it's been annoying me for the longest time. Uh, bring that out a little bit. Bring the roof a little bit longer just to there so it sort of doesn't have that annoying crossover of the the eaves we also got a similar issue there so i think i might actually just make that that you know what let me delete that because we'll probably change this bit of the house um all right so we're gonna have two kids right so we're gonna want more room anyway why don't we greenhouse is there uh i guess we're just gonna extend this way more do something like this, and then I'm going to remove that. I'm going to actually move the door over here. So we'll turn this into our front entrance. Hang on. I'll keep that. I'll just move it over here. So we'll turn that into our front entrance instead, I think. Like this. And we'll, we'll rework some of the interior. And then we're going to have, like, little nice paving outside or something. Outdoor. No, no, no. We want to get... Maybe like this. I do like that. That one's always decent. 
and then maybe that'll come around the side and then it'll be like on the back here. Yeah, so around the side of the house or something. And this is like a little patio area. Hang on, let's move these. So because I want to make sure we still have some outdoor space as well. You know, we need a nice little garden for the dog as well, especially. So I'm going to have a little bit of room there. I'm going to get a picket fence. And we don't see, I really, this is why I kind of wish we were not on an island. Because <laughs> a fence like this would make way more sense. Can just, God, I can't put it anywhere because there's puddles everywhere. So that's going to go like this. Um, I can't really do it. I guess I'll do that. I just wanted a nice little fence around the front of the house or something, you know? So we'll do it there and then we'll get a little gate. Because here's the idea. If we do, oh. Well, bb.move objects. Here's the idea. If we do a, a, a fence around the whole thing, we can lock that door for pets. And then obviously like the, the dog out here in the garden, then it will never run away, right? Because he can't get out technically. <laughs> then we don't have to worry about it too much. I'm going to put the bin, I guess, in there. Uh, the problem with the... You know what? I guess we don't need that. Or we technically don't need that either. I just thought it would look nicer with that little bit of fence there. But because if it doesn't work, then let's not bother with it. Put those there. It's all right, I think. Probably change it. Well, I want to change the wallpaper. I think maybe like a brick or something would be nicer. Nice little brick home. Uh, it's not too bad. It needs to be a little bit more. I think it needs something else. Maybe. I don't know. Brick just looks a little blank to me. You know what I mean? Or do you not, do you not know what I mean? Oh, maybe it's okay. If we just do that. Paint all of that as well and all of this. Keep the greenhouse whatever the hell it wants to be. Um... Was this the same brick? Oh. I never actually noticed that they used the same... I mean, it makes sense because they added in the brick texture that doesn't have that. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. That's cool. All right, do that. Um, house looks a little bit more robust now, which is quite nice. <laughs> looks a little bit more like it, it's a thing. Do we want to try and do an upstairs yet? Or maybe we don't need it yet. Let me get rid of that roof actually real quick. So that's there. I wouldn't mind having maybe a bit of, Oh, actually, this is something you guys have been annoyed about for the longest time, is all the eaves on the, the greenhouse. So I just brought all the eaves in. <laughs> the longest... Actually, is there a... Wait, there's there's a roof that... It, yeah, I want to use this roof. Hang on, get rid of that. I want to use this roof, because then the glass will, like, be on the whole thing, and we won't have a, a wall at the end. So I think it'll look a lot nicer. I still want to use that one, though. I like the fancy-looking one. This is a little steep, though. That's better, because then you have glass everywhere. Look at that! It's beautiful! And then we're going to get like a trim, maybe, that looks good on that. Uh, I mean, I guess it didn't really change much, that one, though. That was just too big, though. Oh, you know, no, it is a little too big. Maybe that one gives it more of a border. All right, let's do that. And then on the top, I would like, yeah, I'd like a, I, think gonna, I think we want a top floor. Maybe. How do we do this? Do we go all the way up to that bit? And then maybe go here a little bit. I don't know. Like, I'm just making this up as I go, quite clearly. We don't have that much money anymore, but we did sell that flower arrangement, so... How do we find... So this is going to go here. Look at this. This is big renovations right now. I'll go through that bit of the build. Bring it down so it's not above it. Nice, nice. And then on top, we'll duplicate this, put it here. Or do we do this one the other way, mate? Yeah, I think it'll look better the other way, actually. So sort of sloping away. Potentially. Wait, no, that definitely doesn't look better the other way. Wait, <laughs> go, go back there. Hang on, I think this one will look better the other way. If we do this on this roof. Yeah. Then bring it in. Okay, this, this will work, this will work. Uh, not like that, though. It needs to be this roof. Whoops. Oh, actually, we could use this roof. Or we just use this roof. I don't know. Let's try. Let's try a few different options. Go all the way along. Obviously, not all the way up like that. Bring it down. Maybe bring it up like there, though. So it sort of goes like that. Then you have that bit of the, the house sort of sticking out there, which I think is quite nice. I think that looks pretty good. Yeah, that's not bad actually. I like it. Oh, I don't like how the, the roof just goes here and doesn't go anywhere. So maybe I'll just actually do that, so it doesn't sort of stick through. Yeah, <laughs> so at least it doesn't do that. Uh, okay, that's cool. Uh, so then this will go all the way along to there. Whoops, to there. And I guess we'll do... Actually, I'll duplicate that, rotate it this way. So the, here's the thing. We're going to have so much room inside that it's actually not filled up with anything. 
because we're not going to have money to fill it up. I think I'll do that because then at least it doesn't look weird on all the sides. It's so blank. We, st we, we still actually don't really have windows on this place, but look at this. Look at this place. It's amazing. Um, okay, well, let's, let's try and get some windows. Now, I guess do we want a door to the outside from here or do we just leave it that you just walk through the greenhouse? I guess we just leave it like that, don't we? At least for now. Okay, uh, interior is probably going to want to change again, actually, after what we just did. Because it doesn't really make a huge amount of sense anymore. Uh, let me move a lot of this stuff again. Oh, wait. No, leave the... <laughs> I put the baby in the inventory. Um, doors you can't put in an inventory, which is kind of annoying, actually. So Because I don't want to sell them. Actually, do they sell for the same... Oh, they sell for the same you buy them for, so I guess it doesn't matter. Right, let's remove all these walls. Because we need, to, we need to open this space up and think about it again. So we've got the room upstairs. So upstairs, I definitely want all the bedrooms, uh, obviously. Now, so if we got the entrance here... Uh, so this is going to be the main living space quite clearly. Like that. Then I think this will be a hallway because that only makes sense. Because then the hallway can lead into the, uh, to the greenhouse. And we can also have some stairs here that go up. These are new stairs, obviously. Wait, how much are these? Oh, $8. Oh my god, these are cheap. Beautiful. So these new stairs will go up. Um, I just don't, the only thing I don't like about them, uh, is that they, it's not filled in underneath. I mean, normally I would love that because it's very, very contemporary. But... I think it's kind of weird in this build, actually. No, you know what? I won't use those stairs. I'll use just, like, regular. Uh, eight bucks. Same price. Give me those. Green stairs? We'll use green stairs. Why not? Okay. <laughs> we, will use, we will use green stairs. Yeah. Actually, can we fit a window into the greenhouse? Because that would actually be really cool. Can we get it? Oh, we can. We get one there. Although, it goes over it a little bit. It's a little bit too big. Maybe this one? No, I think it should be more like... As much glass as possible. Maybe like this. It's like a weird looking window, but I think it will be like suited for looking into the greenhouse. No, we need more. You need more window than that. Is there like a... a what do I like? Something like that. No. There's like a three tile window that like is all glass. Because it looks sweet and it needs to be triangular. It doesn't exist. What about just like this? And it just has to be a low... It has to be lower down so it doesn't clip through the roof. See, if I could just make that all glass and have it looking into that, it'd be sweet. I think we also need to change actually that to um, to be brick now, because otherwise it doesn't make sense. Because it's part of the house. Um, that doesn't work. What about... I just want... I, it should just be open. Like, I want to be able to see it, you know? So it seems like a waste not to have a window to it. Uh, see, these are... No, oh, hang on. These are too big. And there's no... D oh, actually. Ooh. What about this? It's sort of... Oh, wait, actually, you know what? What if we curve it over it a little bit? <gasps> what if we bring it... Hang on. What if I line it up at the top of that and curve it around the window? That's cool. Is that cool? Actually, well, what if I make it a little bit taller? So and then instead we can move the window up higher so it's not so low down. Can't really see where I'm putting it. It's a little too high. So then it sort of fits in perfectly with the curve of the roof. Oh, that to that totally works, right? That's cool. Uh, so then underneath that, uh, can I do a matching window just so we have like some sort of continuity? It would have to be. Oh, we got the stairs there though, so it's kind of doesn't really work as well, does it? No, it doesn't. But whoops. But then we could also maybe I move the stairs. So maybe just put them on the other side and we can just like leave that open. It's like a little open balcony bit. Yeah, that'd be cool actually. Let's do that. Uh, so we do that. Then we can also get the matching door to that. So then at least it kind of all sort of looks good together. Or actually we could even just turn one of these into the door. You know what? That makes more sense. Uh, which one's going to be better? No, this one's going to be this one. Kind of just, I wish it didn't have a mailbox on it. That's the wrong color, but <laughs> get like a little mail slot through it. Is that the same white? I, I realize we don't have a lot of lighting going on right now, so it's kind of hard to tell, but I think it is the same lighting. It's just the lighting is a bit weird. Uh, so washing buckets there. Move that over there. I'll just put it to that side instead. Interesting. <laughs> it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I don't know. I'm, ha I'm having fun with it. Uh, right, so upstairs. Uh, should we use a new fencing, maybe? What do we use? Old school. Look in school Scholastic, if you will. <laughs> Looking scholastic, yeah, that's 
everyone's favorite kind of look. Uh, and then maybe I'll just go to there. Oh, I didn't. Is that not? Oh, I didn't do that bit. Oh, no. Forgot that that was still a thing. Ah, okay. We can't do an open floor space there because you can't complete rooms with fences and have a hole without the roof clipping through, which is really annoying. Uh, I don't know what we do with that space. Then. I mean, like, we can still have the window there. Um, but I liked where, how it all turned out now. Because if you go to, like, live mode now, it's going to be sweet. Like, look at this. Go down here. Oh, look at that person standing outside the window. Look at this. Uh, that's pretty cool. Like, I don't want to change this now. Look at this. That. How is that not awesome? We're just going to figure out the inside. Maybe instead of, we don't, maybe we, we don't do the stairs there. Why don't we move those? Don't have the hallway there. Well, we just... I kind of need a hallway there for that. Maybe we have the stairs like around the corner though. Maybe the stairs like go up here or something. Hang on, let me put, put the stairs back. Put that here instead. Move that wall. Yeah, we're running out of money and quick. Hang on, move the, move the baby. Put them around the corner. So then we don't have to worry about trying to figure out how to leave that open between the floors. And then we can do... That could actually be like a bedroom there. That'd be pretty cool. Mm, okay, we could do like that as an ensuite and bedroom. Okay, well now we've run out of money. Uh, oh no, all these flowers have moved. Oh, it kicked them all off the plants. You know what? Let me just sell them. I know I've said so many times like I don't want to. Oh god, do I? Have to, oh, I actually have to do them like this. I said so many times I don't want to earn money off individual flowers, like selling them straight to the catalog. But at the same time, because we're doing such big renovations right now, it kind of makes sense. Uh. And also they're all in my catalogs. So it's super annoying. And there's no other... Oh, why did it do this? <laughs> That's annoying. I wish I'd harvested them first. That would have been great, wouldn't it? Well, at least we have a few thousand dollars. So we're at least trying to get some more windows in. Like we won't, we won't get a lot done with the budget that we have. But we'll at least hopefully have a functional place to live again. Don't mind me just spamming cell and all these. There we go. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to keep doing this in terms of like selling all the flowers constantly. Because it's... That's just not who I am, okay? It's just not acceptable. <laughs> uh, almost done. I just want to make sure I don't sell anything that I actually want to keep. Wow, we have eight, nine thousand dollars from doing this. Okay, there we go. Right now, <laughs> now we have enough to uh, just do the layout and all that. Okay, so I was thinking if we do that as like a ensuite, then the bedroom could be maybe here. Like that. Like it's a bit weird, but it sort of works. And have another bedroom there, maybe. And although it doesn't, it kind of. Hmm. See, I would like, you know what, actually, maybe that, maybe that should not be an ensuite. Maybe that's just a regular bedroom. Because then we can do, oh, look, the hallway's pretty small, but it means we can get two decently sized bedrooms there. Maybe a smaller ensuite. Oh, actually, we could just do like this. Have like family bathroom, ensuite. Oh, those are two big bedrooms. Like that, that bedroom is way bigger than that one. So it doesn't really... Unless we, no, maybe we shuffle this room along instead, do it the other way around, to so do it there, have an ensuite here, family bathroom there, and then this bedroom just gets a window to the greenhouse, which is pretty cool. I mean, it would be nice as the, uh, no, there's gonna, hang on, there's gonna be a way to do this. I want that to be the master bedroom, because it's sweet. Oh, hang on. There we go. Hold up. This, this can work, this can work. This, like, it's such a nice room. Let me just do this. Okay, so let's say that's a bedroom there. Then this is obviously gonna have to be a hallway. Maybe even a little bit longer along to here. And we have a bedroom. Yeah, see, th these rooms get really... It's really you can't really divide the space into two rooms. It kind of has to be one. Is the issue. We do bathroom. Bathroom. So maybe one, the smaller one's an ensuite or something? I don't know. And then we can have... Well, that one can obviously take up the end of the hallway. It doesn't need, you don't even need it to go down there, but we will. So that can go there. Bedroom at the end, which would be quite nice, I think. Uh, then this space is just kind of not used. And maybe we just do two bedrooms for now. Or maybe we do, I don't know, this doesn't really work. It's not a great layout, but whatever. That's fine for now. <laughs> All right, so then this could be the living, I reckon this is a living room, and then this is like kitchen dining or something, or maybe we even do a separate dining room. Oh yeah, because if, especially if it was like formal dinners and that, like we have a dinner party, that'd be cool. Maybe we do like an old style, have like a dining room here, and the kitchen like behind it. 
So like we go like this. You know what? I need some bloody lights in here is what I need. Where where are all the lights? There's one there. Did I... Where did all the others go? Are they in here? No, we do have a couple of these though. Put them out here. What is this? Holly. Okay. Well, hollies are actually not going to grow right now. So I'm going to sell that. Get my gnomes out. Because they should be in the garden somewhere. We'll sort out all the garden stuff in a bit. Okay. So, I don't know where all the lights went. Maybe they... Oh, actually, no, they're there. Hang on. Turn on all lights. Let me just do that so I can see where they are at least. Yeah, they're, they're around. There's one in here. <laughs> the flooring in this place is all over the place. So, there's one there. There's one there, one there. Do we only have three? I guess so. Is this another one somewhere? I don't know. Alright, we get one here. I'm just gonna leave them large for now so we can sort of see where they are. Okay, so that's all gonna go up like that. Now, in here... Actually, we should probably have a bathroom downstairs. Yeah, maybe we... We're gonna be, instead of doing an ensuite there, we... What if we... The thing is, we could probably fit... What if we just make it bigger this way? It's kind of an annoying hallway, but it would, it would work. And then we can try and get two bedrooms here, in this space. Maybe, see like, if you did the bedrooms like this, because then you definitely get the two... Why can't I... Why is control not working to remove walls? Something weird. No, remove the wall, there we go. You just need to be able to get to that better. I get, you know what, we just make that bedroom a bit smaller, we can have a hall... Like, it's, it's a weird hallway, but it works. <laughs> But it means we, we don't have anywhere for an ensuite right now unless we cut into this room. There's no family bathroom upstairs. Unless we add it somewhere else. I mean, this room does not need to be this big. Because the bed is only, what, like that big? But it's nice and luxurious, so I like it. <laughs> Alright, here's what we do. Family bathroom there. Uh, we could have like a wardrobe there built in. This room's getting smaller by the second. And then there's not any room. Well, why would you have two hallways like that? That makes no sense. Because that's just a way. Then you just have too many walls everywhere. That's how I guess, I guess it would make sense as a bathroom. And then have maybe the entrance of the bedroom here. But then you have all this weird space. Like, what what is going on with. You have so much wasted space, like, right here. So, it, look, it's a bad layout. I'm not going to lie. But whatever. We're rolling with it. All right, let's just let's just work with it because otherwise I'm gonna be here for years. All right, so door there, door to that room. These doors are all like right next to each other, but that's just where they go. And then we're gonna have an ensuite door here. They have a small ensuite, but they have one. Okay. Then we have a bed that can go here. No, we'll do it this side actually. Actually, no, that's really bad because the door is right there. So I want to. I would put it here, but then we get that space, which would be good for a wardrobe. Or we just do it against the window. Actually, that's not too bad. The bed head doesn't go too far above it. That's actually not the worst. Yeah, that's alright, actually. Let's do that. And then we can turn this into a wardrobe. That goes right there. Hey, here we go. Uh, This one. Build it in like that or something. So we've got those guys there. Okay, so that's that. Let's just work. Let's work with that for now. Baby will go in this room here. Hang on, baby room. Okay, downstairs. Uh, what I'm thinking is we do. So we got the hallway. The main hallway will be this room over here, or this section there, which I will use. Maybe just that square. Actually, is there? Um, no, I think the the archer I'm thinking of is that one. Maybe we make that. Should we make the lower floor taller? No, I think the size is good. No, let's leave it. Well, in that case, we can use we could use the fancy one, but I feel like that's a little too much for this kind of build. That's too little. Because we just have to use a square one, which I didn't really want to. Because hmm. what I would what I want you know what actually what about um? Why don't we use like French doors? So it goes into the hallway there, and then from this hallway, this arches to the the dining room. Should be there. And then a smaller door into the other room or like a smaller archway. It's a very um look, it's a very this is a very quirky house, and I think we've established that fact. And it's gonna be quirky. Occasionally Albuquerque. Albuquerque. <gasps> Springfield I have to type some movie to Albuquerque. 
Uh, maybe just put it there, because then they can just walk through like that as well, which would be good. You know what? I need a door. Get rid of that one. Maybe, should we just do another set of French doors there? You know what? Let's do that, because then that can be a nice, like, TV spot there and have, like, a little central... That's all right. We'll do that, and then from the dining room, we'll do a smaller door, like a small archway, so we don't have to use up all the wall space. Okay, this is a this is a renovation episode. Everybody's favorite, not everybody's, but hey, we did get a dog. Is this room even big enough? I, I don't know. This room is kind of like uh, I'll put it there because it needs to be sort of out of the way. Um, I don't know that it is big enough, but we'll find out. Oh, I thought I did that. Okay, kitchen wise. I think I want to use some different tiles. Wait, what else do we have? What about like these? No, they come in terrible colors. No, I want tiles. Why am I not in the tiles category? Um, I do like those greeny counters. Especially because it also goes with our beautiful stairs that we're building. You know what we still don't have? We still don't have windows. <laughs> we, we still haven't done windows anywhere. What are these? Are they, so there's like a... No, we can't use, we can't use like blue. Um, what about these and like a? I don't know, man. Doesn't, why do we have three different floors in? And yeah, we could probably just leave it as the the wood that we have, like that. Okay, so we do that. <laughs> that kitchen is horrendous. I would like it'd be nice to craft some of our own furniture, but we can't really we can't do it now because their skill is not high enough. Well, actually, what do we need? You know what? That's what I should focus on. Okay, dining room first of all in there, beautiful. <laughs> all right, bathroom. We need a downstairs bathroom is what we should probably have. I don't know where it would go because I'd like to do a larger table in there. Obviously, fill it up. But a bathroom maybe at the end of the hallway. No, there's not enough room. We only have two tiles there. Have to cut in somewhere, maybe at the back of the kitchen, actually. Oh, yeah, that'll work if we do it here. Have the door from the dining room. Like I said, it's a very quirky build. I mean, we could make it part of the hallway, actually. Maybe that'll just be a little bit neater. But then they just cut stuff. You know, no, we'll leave it as part of the dining room. We'll do that. All right, so that will go like that. We'll give it those tiles. Uh, we'll get out another light. Just one of these. And then this will be our current main bathroom. So that'll go there. Get a tub thing there. We don't have room for a sink. We do now, though. You know what? I'm going to get a sink. I know you guys have been wanting one for ages. Keep saying, hey, when, when are you getting a sink? You you don't, you don't get a sink. Get, get one. Why aren't you getting one? And I'm like, I'm not going to get one ever. I never said that, but... I'm just going to paint all the walls as standard, like... Wallpaper. There we go. All right, so then all of this can just be this flooring as well. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Okay, so the living space, which is this room here, uh, doesn't really have any windows, so we need to do that. Let's get some more of these. Get them there. Do we want to do it? Do we want to do large windows on that side too? I, think, I feel like we should have smaller windows this way because it's sort of looking out to the world. Also, I don't want to cover this room in windows. It's the other thing too. <laughs> we got to be we got to be cautious of that. We don't need huge windows everywhere. Uh, get some, we'll get some smaller ones for this section, I think. Maybe a couple for the kitchen area, and then one for the bathroom there. Uh, we don't really need many windows on this side of the house either. Just a couple smaller ones. At the top is actually almost the same, because it's just a hallway. So we just do that, like it's... Oh god, actually that looks... Ugh, that looks so bad, because of where the roof is. Like, you'd really want a window there, or move this one... Oh no, this one has to be there. But then the stairs are there, so it doesn't work. That'd be oops, have to be higher up. And then you get an additional window over here, like that. Because otherwise it looks really oh wow, those are so low now though. Compared, because I have to move that one up because of the stairs. Otherwise the stairs sort of cut through the window, which never looks good. But now these ones look weird because they're super low compared. To oh man. Maybe we just don't worry about it. Maybe what we do, we cover it up. Cover it up. Hide the sin. I write sins, not tragedy. Uh, <laughs> okay, that's too big. Uh, how much do these cost? 230 bucks. Uh, disguises it a little bit. Alright, and then, the, okay, so we definitely want bigger windows uh, for the bedrooms as well. So, like, up here. Uh, why don't we just do this? No. Uh, yeah, you know what? No. Uh, is, there a, is there a double version of that? Or is it only triple and single? Actually, that's not even the same window, is it? Um, 
Is there no single version of that? There's cats and dogs windows. Oh, there's this, but it doesn't have... Hmm. So we have the full height window, we got the triple. But no in between. What about these? Do these windows match anything at all? I don't think so. Hmm. Okay. Just because that doesn't really work for us. We'd have to go there. Or we just do different windows. Because um, th these ones, they obviously match the same sort of style, but they're a little too big. You know what I mean? They're just a little too tall. So why don't we use some of these? I don't know. I was having to find some by the time I said that. What about this? No. <laughs> I, guess, I mean, I guess I can just use that. It's not the end of the world. Uh, it's not going to fit there, though, because the wall is too small. Um, around the over here, I think that should probably be using windows that are there's taller versions of those ones. So maybe like these. Maybe a little taller than that. No. That's fine. Do something like that. That's fine. Look, it's not it's almost pretty house. And we're not we're also not made of money, so you get what you pay for, okay? Which is literally not not much because we can't afford much. And four windows there. Just to sort of cover that wall a little bit. So it's just above the uh, the roof line there as well. And then get plenty of windows. I mean this room is kind of depressing actually. Get some more around the side. A couple there, maybe. The windows are a little taller in that room, but that's all we can do, so that's fine. Um, that window there is really annoying me because it doesn't work really. It just doesn't work. Well, you know what? That's what we got for now. It's mostly about the greenhouse. Look at that. The greenhouse is, the greenhouse is beautiful. Uh, I think that's all that matters. Now, my selling table, if we're going to be selling stuff to people, it can't be in the garden, can I? We also didn't really leave any room. Um, I wonder if we could do like a, um, can we do like a cutout in the thing? Like, what if we put it here? Oh, whoops. And then we go like this. And then, like, because no one can walk past that, sure. Although, if he's trying to do sales pitch, he's going to have to walk around to the night, isn't he? Okay, no, let's not do that. Make it, see, it's a three by bloody three. That's the problem with this lot, it's too small. I can move the whole house. No, that's not what I meant to do. Move the whole house back, at least a little bit, to there. So we have a little bit more room at the front. What did I just, what happened? I don't want to, I don't know what it sold, and I don't want to find out. Um, okay, well, I like my garden, though. I'm going to have to remove some of the garden to make it happen, though. It's unfortunate, but it's the truth. I'll do this. There. I just don't want people in my garden. <laughs> so dumb, though. So, it's so sad. It's such a nice little corner. Such a nice little garden that we had. Oh, well, whatever. Um, all right, so living room's looking good. Um, that's nice. Let's get a bin in the kitchen. We got a dog bowl in the kitchen too. You know what? Why don't we get some more counters? There you go, because you know what? We probably don't need to waste money on those. Let's not do that. Let's spend that on something else. But I will get uh, a sink in the kitchen, because otherwise we're all going to go over to that sink now instead of just using the one in the kitchen. I'm also going to use a cheap one. So that hopefully it breaks a lot and we can fix it a lot and get our skill up and upgrade stuff. Uh, Alright, so that's going to go there. You know what? Can we do a, a dog door that goes from here? We have a big dog door, don't we? You're a big dog. A big doge. Problem is it's going to look pretty bad, isn't it? Oh, actually, you know what? that's not too bad. Maybe we get a nice little wall decoration above it. Like, uh, where is the... Not really... Ne not strictly necessary, but... Can we get, oh my god, so many decorations. Can we get uh, the thing that goes on the wall that looks like a hose, that is a hose, just above it. There you go, so now it looks like it's, it's beautiful. Look at that. And now, these plants that we have in our garden, I'm at least going to, let's just move, over, move them over here so they at least look like there's some sort of order to what we've done out here. <laughs> some form of order, maybe just a little bit. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to turn off bb.move objects too. So I'm just going to sort of shuffle these together a little bit. Most of the, as much as I can be. There you go. And there, and then the last one. Uh, just like this. Beautiful. All right, gnomes. Um, you can hang out. I do like the... Whoops, I do like the clothesline there. Let's move it over a little bit. 
Maybe these come over here. They can hang out here for now. I mean, they'll move around probably later on in the year when uh, <laughs> maybe on Queen's birthday again. But they'll, they'll hang out there for now. Beautiful. Okay, so that's there. Now we've got a clothes hamper, which I would say would go in the bathroom. But we don't actually have that much room in the bathroom. I'll put it in the bedroom. That'll be fine. Makes sense anyway. Uh, we've got our romantic VIP bucket. Go on the floor. And a dog bed, which is not going to fit in the bedroom anymore. Uh, you can go in the baby's room again. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so we've pretty much spent all our money. And really not got anything more to show for it. We have a lot more space though. We're ready to expand and buy more stuff, which is good. I do, I think my fa you know what, my favorite thing. It's got to be that, that uh, window looking into the, the greenhouse, right? Where is it? Look at that. Isn't that cool? I think this would be really cool for a home office more than anything. More than a bedroom, but it's a pretty cool view. You wake up, you're like, hmm, how's, how's the greenhouse going? Is it good? It's good. You know what? Can we get a... Um, again, this is our thumbnail. It's a pretty good one. It looks pretty good. I reckon I could probably work with this, maybe. Would you click on this? I mean, I guess you already did if you're here. There. Now, look, we didn't get a lot of gameplay done this episode, which is a bit unfortunate, but we did have to do some building anyway. But it means tomorrow... We actually didn't even progress one day. It means tomorrow uh, we got Fool's Day, which is going to be a bit of fun. Also, keep suggesting more holidays because I had some more in. I mean, we can we can really go crazy with holidays and do stuff all over the place if we want to. Um, I think we should do a holiday for the first of each season, like people suggested as well. That was a good one. So we'll come up with some of those down below. Uh, but until next time... That's going to be our Ranks Riches Seasons. We've got a little bit more of a house going on now. Look at this place. It's beautiful. I do... I still want to... I still want to move the house. I still want to be somewhere else. No, it's not... I'm not... It's not so much the space. I kind of just want to be on a road. Like, <laughs> so we can do like a, a proper street sale that isn't on a random island, you know? Does that make sense to you? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.